right now um, I've got a team of just quality young women who uh, come into the practice gym every day wanting to get better. Um, they've set some high goals for themselves to finish in the top of the conference. Um, right now our record might not reflect that um, as we've just been through some transition, um, new coaching staff. Um, so for us it's just about getting better every single day and one thing we've talked about with them is just uh, looking for progress rather than perfection. Um, not, not worrying so much about outcome but the process and um, every day just looking as an opportunity to give it their all and uh, do everything for the Lord um, and uh, yeah it's just uh, they're motivated they um, they want to get better some of my players are asking all the time to come in for quality repetition to come in and get extra time in the gym um, and those are things that you can't force your team to do and it's just a, a drive and a will to want to want to be the best they can be and um, so yeah just a great group I love working with them at the beginning of the season the the, the team said that they want to win a conference championship and um, I think they've realized that it's they have got to put in the work to be able to do that and um, to have that mentality that um, it's not going to be easy to get there and uh, they have to be willing to sacrifice and put in that extra time. So I'll right now just talk about a little bit what we're trying to get better at. Um, there will be times when we're up in a match and we kind of just take a deep breath and say, oh, we're winning. And then we allow teams to kind of just be able to believe that they can come back and win. And um, so us really just, when we get up, stay up and keep the pressure on and finish out a set. Um, knowing how to just put the pressure on all the time rather than relaxing and um, allowing a team to think that they can come back. Um, so just a little bit of that uh, fight to stay up all the time and to push through a set. Um, so that's an area that we're definitely working on. Um, I will say when we're down, uh, one thing that's a strength for us is we never give up. Um, the inner fight with this team is just unbelievable. There's been sets where we're down five, six, seven points, come back to win the set. Um, they're just they're, they're relentless, they're resilient. Um, and that's, some, that's something they got to have. It's all about the choice that they make in the heart. And um, seeing them work together as a team, like that's really special and something I'm proud of when I see them. Of course, I don't want to ever get put in that situation. And that's something we're working on, that consistency part of it. Um, but yeah, they're, that's definitely a strength that they never give up. We're a small squad in comparison to a lot of other programs. I have 12 on my roster. Um, and so we talk about how important it is for every single player to bring it their best. Um, because this is all we've got. We're only as good as our weakest link. And um, we, we need everybody to play their best for us to be successful. And, um, but as far as like personality wise, um, we're, we're kind of across the board. We've got some players who are just, when they're on the court, they're very just kind of loosey goosey. They like to joke, they like to have fun. And then we have others that are just very serious. So um, I think they're, they're learning how to work with that different dynamics on the court, how to motivate each other. Uh, I think as a coaching staff, we're still learning that too. How do some players respond if I get in their face versus like maybe they just need some reassurance, that type of thing. Um, so we're, it's still a big learning process for us right now. Um, I have two captains, um, my starting setter, Peyton Anderson and Zoe Wolfenberger, and they both bring very different uh, leadership qualities. Um, Peyton is very calm, relaxed. Um, she's that consistency piece for us, and she runs our offense very well, and I think the team looks to her for that consistency. And then Zoe, she's an attacker, a right side slash outside attacker, and she really just, she's that fireball. She just plays all out. Um, I think the team looks to her for like calm confidence and also they look to her to just be like everything's going to be okay um, and just to play all out. Um, she, she just, um, she's a go-getter out there on the court and I think she leads by example in that way and just motivates our younger players um, to, be, to be fearless out there. Um, and so you know they're a great duo because they balance each other out so well and uh, you need both for the team to be successful. So um, they've done a great job so far this season. I'm gonna continue to look to them to lead this team. Um, we, are, we are on the younger side. We have two seniors. Um, and so uh, we, we're, a little bit, we're a little bit younger, and, um, but the team hasn't used that as a, a reason to not be great.